from Southwest Florida's Morning News Source. This is Fox 4 News Rising. It may shock you, but did you know that more than 30 million Americans are losing or have lost their teeth? Unfortunately, many of them are not even candidates for traditional dental implant procedures. Here to talk about this problem as well as options for those affected are Dr. Paolo Mallow and Dr. Stephen Moss. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Carly. Let's first talk about why is this problem so widespread? Well, it has to do with the demographics of our population, not only here in this country, but around the world. The um, elderly portion of our population is the most rapidly growing. And the longer we're alive and on this planet, the more likely we are to lose our teeth, whether it be from periodontal or gum disease or dental decay or, um, God, uh, God forbid, a dental uh, an accident where your teeth are knocked out. But um, sooner or later, you are going to lose one, two, or maybe all of your teeth. And uh, we do know that the number you quoted is closer to about 37 million Americans now in this country without uh, without their teeth. So it's a significant number. And it's growing, unfortunately. Well, tell it, me a little bit, I guess, about the traditional um, implant procedure, uh, procedures and then now why they're kind of not very effective. Yeah, I'll let Dr. Malo talk about his breakthrough. Uh, but traditionally, over the past decades, since implants were introduced in the early 80s in this country, um, dental implants can only be placed in bone, and, and we were taught uh, and brainwashed that they need to be straight up and down, and we needed 8 or 10 or 12 implants to support a full bridge because we thought they acted like teeth, but they really don't. They bond with the bone um, so strongly, um, unlike teeth, which are connected to the bone by a, a dental, a periodontal ligament, rather. Um, and so they behave very differently. And um, Dr. Malo figured out that we shouldn't be limited by the anatomical structures that are often in the way, the, the sinus in the upper jaw and the, and the nerve canal in the lower jaw. And uh, so he placed those implants on an angle and came up with his revolutionary all on four. Yeah, doctor, go ahead and talk about this new procedure that you've invented and created. And it sounds like it, it's doing wonders. Yeah, well, uh, it's actually, um doing wonders in the sense that it's the most revolutionary technique in the last 40 years in our rehabilitation and uh, and of course we received a lot of prizes and uh, and honors for that around the world but this all started about 18 years ago when we found out that uh, about 20 uh, percent of the cases of people without teeth could not be treated uh, in a standard way meaning without bone transplants or bone grafting and uh, bone grafting is a major concern because not only it basically doubles the price of the of the rehabilitation but also uh, the success rate is very low in the elderly population which is the population that is in most need the third thing is that basically uh, quite a large number of this elderly population they do have diabetes and other kind of systemic disease and we could not do the implants so these people were stuck with a danger that just basically ruined the quality of life and made their life miserable. So what we came up with was a system, a technology, which is basically a surgical concept or protocol, if you will, if you will that does not need to, uh, to do the bone grafting. So this is a major breakthrough because in less than one hour we can deliver fixed teeth that look like and feel like and act like a normal dentition, a natural dentition, for almost half the price with almost 100% success rate. And this can be applied to anybody without teeth, regardless if he's got a, a systemic uh, disease or, or not. So in that sense, this was a major breakthrough, and that's why we became so famous around the world. I can see why. Well, where would somebody know if they're a candidate or where they can go? Where, where do you send them for more information about this? Well, they can visit us on our website uh, for more information. It's www.maloclinics.com or www.malodentalimplants.com here in the United States. That's M-A-L-O, dentalimplants.com. All right, doctors, thank you so much. Carly, thank, you, thank Carly. you. Have a great day. You too. We're going to put all that information on our website as well so it's easy for you to find. Of course, that is fox4morningblend.com.